All right, so I have made my delicious strawberry banana smoothie. Two thumbs up, one, two. And now it's time to clean the blender. The deluxe cooking blender has a self clean feature. So I have given it a little spritz in the kitchen sink to get anything off of it. And when you clean it quicker, when you clean it um, closer to the time that you finish cooking, it's so much easier to, to clean. So if you just give it a quick little rinse, it practically takes care of everything. But I'm gonna show you the, the heated clean cycle. So it's just three cups of water. And I would usually just pour that straight out of my kitchen sink tap. And then a couple drops of dish soap. Lid goes on, lock it into place. And then down here we have the heated wash cycle. So you're gonna just change it to till it hits that. And it sets the temperature to 140 degrees. That's gonna heat the water and blend it around. It's gonna start, it's gonna pulse. So I'm gonna let it get started. I'm gonna pause and then I'll talk again. So it's gonna blend it around and it's gonna pause and heat up the water to 140 degrees. And then it's gonna go again to kind of sw um, swish it up against the glass and against the lid to get it all cleaned up. It takes a few minutes, five to 10 minutes maybe. And then a little trick that I like to do is if I have other dishes that I wanna wash, I use the hot soapy water from the, the blender to wash my other dishes. So once it's done here, it gets all of the stuff off, cleans it, sanitizes it. You're gonna to wanna to rinse off all the hot soapy water and get it clean, dry it off and put it away and it is done. So it is so easy, you don't need to scrub, scrub, scrub. Um, but if you do have the utensil scrubber, it's great for getting anything that's stuck around the top um, where the lid meets the glass. Sometimes there's a little bit of stuff that's underneath that that is hard to, um, that doesn't get the water swishing against it so it doesn't necessarily get cleaned off as fast. So anyways, it's a great feature. I love the self-clean because it's really a two for one. You clean the blender and then you clean whatever dishes that you need to wash too. So love that and thanks for watching. You'll have to give it a try.